Hello guys, today is the night of the matchup for the final game in game two of the double header. This is where we come down into Seattle Kraken and LA Kings. Right at this moment, I will be commentating for tonight along with the along with the other crews of Paintbrush and Lightbulb right towards from the right side. As of this moment, this will be the next part of it as Seattle has already won their first game over the Kings with a great combination of 3 and 2 to 4 and 3. This was one of the best successful range that Seattle has ever made since their first time in the franchise history of the making. And this is the point that they are moving on to make this one come to life. Well, let's find out what happens here for the next game. We'll find out if there is another goal to make that one in a chain. Now let's get started at Crypto.com Arena. Enjoy the next game, folks, and right at this moment, let's do it. Hello everyone, Test 2 Peter along with Paintbrush and Lightbulb. This is NHL Game 2 of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. About to get started here at Crypto.com Arena. The match is on. Kings and Kraken. Hook drop, and we are underway. Here we have is Anze Kopitar along with Jones, who started starting goaltender for the Kraken. The other side of the players that we have is is, is on the other way player. We have is Drew Doughty. Now Drew Doughty was definitely one of the only uh, players of the South Star that made that one a goal and terrific part of the game. His moment has really turned out one of the bestest. On the other hand, right now, as Dunn really is showing it up with a great prioritize and trying to take him over for the game. This ultimately is giving up a one too many of terrific goals here in this game. As for Dunn, he made that one a great stopping advantage to make that run play smarter and do for his best. I'll be keeping eyes on both two players right over the lead to cross. Back to you. And McCann with a good, with a team effort. Back to you. Corpusella save me. That's a starting goaltender for the Los Angeles Kings. Then we have on the other side, we have McCann. Then it's Beneers. Over on the other side now, we have this, we have this Larson. Then from here is, is Eberly. Now here's Eberly, he will try to sing it up. That stop made by Corpusella. An air shot saved by Corpozello. We'll hold the puck with only 18.32 to go to start and underway for an L.A. Now the players are ready to take him bounding here in the offensive zone. We'll take, try to take him over with the defenseman. Kopitar wins the faceoff and Roy will give it off to Gavrikov. Byfield has it over right to Kempe. The Kings are in offense. Put it back down, and now they will have to reset it here on offense. So it's pretty very hard. You know, that tricky motion is putting up an offense to put up a spring and injury. Might have to just keep it over right from instead. Jones is going to hold it here with only 17.51 remaining in the first period. Now they're ready to take the offense in the zone. Still no score this game, as it's still zero. Do not wins the faceoff. That's blocked. Or shot right over into Seattle to Kraken in the Kings territory. Gabrikov wins it. Try to take it over with the rebound again to Roy. Roy smashing it over to Arvidsson. Arvidsson to Denault. Denault smashes across. Fiala right over into the wing. On her run, Arvidsson loves it up by Jones. Jones is going to hold it with here with only under 17 minutes. And both teams are trying to get an inbounding. They're everywhere. You know that there's sea monsters out there happening here with the, with the attack here in the Pacific. The coast is real, but not really consuming if they are going to get this offense straight away. You know, they're really that tough. And be honest with you, they're nothing but they have done it before. Donato, shot stopped here by Corbisalo and Arvidsson right on the other side again to Fiala. Here's Fiala right towards the wing in the offense zone, now going back over again. Olesayek over now to Donato. Donato passes to Olesayek. Now over to Tolmanen. Seattle into the Kings territory. Goes down with the broken play. Olesayek over again with the offense run. Pass again to Gordy. Gordy and it didn't really set it up to Porgen, but now he has one to Donato. 
Donato Pat broken up the play, and it's Velarde. He goes right around the net. Osayek will try to take it over for the wing in the corner. I follow will try to rebound it over to Walker. In this pack, Lizette bashed up. Don't save. Try to smash it across here, and Benier's got one. They will have to hold it with just only 14.34 to go. A lot of battle to take the tape feeds. They're like naked to each other because of Alardi and Borgen. They're just going to have to get over this one down there. And a topable inbounding. Play is no exception. Now here's Dowdy. Oh, that smashy monster goes right into the king. Kupari over and right across to Anderson Dolan. Dolan shot backhand and stopped by Jones. 14-10 to go in the first period. They're trying to get over with the offense to pick up their struggle run. Now here they are, now in the offensive wing to pick up the faceoff. Now with the win is Larson. Here's Stein, he will have it over again to Veneers. Veneers went down. Kupari takes it over to Anderson Dolan. Dolan shot, stop made by Jones. Everly over into the corner, finding a room open to Veneers. Veneers goes down, hello, big smash. They're always everywhere. Gotta have to be very careful of who you're gonna find a man opener. They really are trying to show him up. Kayaev over again to Anderson Dolan. Dolan shot, gloves saved by Jones. Well, Holden was just coming down the wire for 13.04 to go. Now he's another face-off look, as right now they have it still up ahead. And now with the win, Larson will try to dish it over again to Borstad. Borstad to Dunn. Dunn past to Swartz. Kraken moving in to the Kings territory. Shot that went right toward the corner of the wall. Try to give it up to play in mounting. Now finds Anderson. Over again to Kopitar. Five field over across into the offense zone. Now picking up the run. Try to help the team out. Wenberg got it across to Swartz. Swartz to Wenberg. Stopped by Corpus Allo. Again, Swartz. Kopitar gets a puck over to Anderson. Now finds Kempe. Kings are on a fast break. Trying to go over to run. Larson trying to put it back. Boyfield stopped by Jones with a save. They're really offensive on that run because they were really showing it off like they did. And they're not easy to try to leave them over. Still scoreless in this game, and it's still an O's. 11 24 to go in the first period. Trying to look for someone else to put in an offensive play and inbound. Houston Nev, he will try to fire it across around the net. Now finds Gavrikov. Gavrikov over again to, to Walker. Walker gets fumbled up. Now Osayek will try to take it over again. Pass to Borgin. Borgin right into the center of the zone. Try to make a shot. Glove saved by Corbisalo and Gavrikov will try to give it over to I follow. Los Angeles carrying the puck into the neutral to offense zone. Tenev takes it away. One-on-one -on -one fast break going right to the corner. Won't help him get away with this, but Gavrikov again to Lizette. Now finds that follow right towards the wing. Pushes across here. I follow. Pass to Roy. Open look! That's over again to Alasayek. Geeky right into the wing on the left. Moving around with the puck. Finds Borgen. Borgen to Saucy. Sashi shot, stopped by Corbisalo with a pad, and it goes right towards the glass. Sashi to Borgen, fires across, and deflection went in for Sponge! That's his first goal in the playoff deflection, and they've got that one a great start for the Kraken over on the line. We know that this was turning out because Daniel Sponge was already been playing inbounding. He has a, one of his only save after Brodin gives it over to Scrunge with the goal, and that deflection was right in it. That's how the offense was keeping it right towards the offense line. And there for that, for that moment, Daniel Scrunge may have another way to give us what a good eye on the key setup. He might be looking for another different player, but hopefully on that one, he might keep it arranged tight. I'll be watching him for the next part to keep an eye on him for the second goal. That's you.
They're really on an offensive run because they are already battling for that puck to make it loose chain. I mean, Walker and her team, they really are starting to get a little bit harder to go with that one. They got to get over this on a better shot angle. Kraken will have their possession to get, 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 uh, take it over. Tolman in shot, scores! Denied it with the goal, that's 17 in the playoffs. They're already showing up right now. Donato is putting up on Tolvanen. And Tolvanen giving given up to Donato. They're already going right around it. Kraken has the lead extension to 2-0 over the King score. They're trying to extend their run to try to help him pay off the price. Saoji and her team are really wanting to move on to the Western Conference Finals to face against the winning team. They're not really important to win the whole thing, but the Kings say they want to win. But they never really want to do that one because if they win, we don't want them to move on to the next game. It's going to be very tough than you know it before. Now with the shot. Stop made by Corbozala. Here's another pack COVID. Puck around the net. And Swoltz will have it over into the offense zone and the wing finds for shot. Six minutes to go in the first period. Fires across in the corner and it's stopped by Corbisalo. Kopitar will give it off to Kempe. He's Kempe over it again to Anderson. Now finds Kopitar. Kopitar finding it and gloves saved by Jones. 5.33 left to play in the first period and it's a 2-0 lead. Now they're ready to do another face-off. Seattle Kraken extending the run 2-0. Los Angeles gets a win in the face-off. A little bumble down here, right behind the blue line. Eberle to Vacan. Shot stopped by Corbizalo. Kupari into the wing. On oh, the defensive breakdown now. They were already just showing it up, like he never really wanted to do it. Here's McCann. We'll try to deliver it up from here to Kalian. Shot blocked. Everly right into the corner of the wall. Trying to make a move, it's sloppy. Everly to McCann, shot stopped by Corbisalo. Saving and mounting is now putting up a loose chain. Now to get ready for another faceoff. Now to ready for another one to make an attacker run, go with it between the inbounds. It's still up to a lead. Roy will have the puck inbounding. Pass off to Arvidsson. Arvidsson right over into the into the wing. Everly takes it over. Smashed up the corner. From the wall into offense. Trying to look for the run. Roy finds the nut. After steal, here comes again for Fiala. Fiala trying to work his way around and Jones pat stop. Jones will give it up to Larson. Now Larson might have another way to make that one play a motion drive. They're very really harmless, but don't get over covered because they really are showing them off like they did. Time pass to Donato. Finds Gordy. Gordy lost the puck and Kempe will try to steal it. Kopitar on the offense. Gordy takes it over. 2.23 left to remain in the first period. Now gives off to Kempe. Kempe and her team are working their way down to the line in the Kings territory, to Kraken territory. Showing their run, we have another run for Donato. Donato right towards the wing on the outside, now swinging it off. Gavrikov right towards the wing, now finds five field again to Kopitar. Kopitar right toward her, and Larson still has it right across. Pass misconnected. Icy whistle here on Seattle. A minute and nine remaining in the first. Now they're ready to do another face-off in the attacking zone. We're almost done with the second per first period as right now two and zero oh score for Seattle. Just a minute to play in the first period as they still have no scores for the Kings. Ball shot over right into the wing. Pass over to Gordy. Now finds Larson. Larson right towards the wing. The offense run pick up steam. Tolman ball! 
That's a sea monster down! Oh man, that king defenseman just really got that with a piece of it. Trying to put a payback. Save my Jones. Osayek went into the corner, trying to keep the puck alive. Orstraw pass to Tolvanen from deep range, and that will be out of reach. So I will end the Kraken with a 2-0 lead. We got the second period coming up in just a few moments. Be right back after this. Period number two about to begin in LA. Time to get set, as right now they're both players are rehydrated and we are ready. Here's Dowdy right into the center, and Kopitar right towards the outside now finds Anderson. Anderson trying to get it past the campaign. Jones pick up a save here. That'll stop the inbounding with only 1927 for the start of the second period. They're already been starting up right away. They're already on the fast break. But you may not want to give that one a call over again because they're really good in the offense. They're like trying to pick up a stride. They really wanted to get them out of here. Anderson went blocked. Kempe right towards the outside. Now in the inside by field around net. Benia Solarsen. Now brings it over to Everly. He's now all alone by himself trying to look for any someone else. McCann shot blocked. Corpusalo again to Anderson. Now pass to Kopitar into the wing. Finding the pass to Byfield. Shot stopped by Jones. Larson again to McCann. Gets fumbled out for the corner here and now rebounding it is Kopitar. A lot of battles in this bounding. It can be very a difficulty. Don't get uncomfortable. You really are going to try to mess somebody up if you're going to do it. Shot went wide and went right off the wall. The target's not very well and proper lies because they should not be doing it. So you shouldn't get that shot and go way outside. The marker is unbearably tough. Now finds McCann. Shot back, saved it over by the Kings of Corpozalo. Dying in the center. Horse shot off saved by Corpozalo. 17 minutes and counting down. As right now, we got the face-off ready for action. Nearing a late going to this period, because right now, they still have a 2-0 lead for Seattle. Denault right to Roy, and now he will give it over to Arvidsson to keep up the run. Denault over again in the wing. Can't find an open man advantage, and Wenberg over again in the center. Shot was blocked. Wenberg! Rebound and Schultz, inbound saved by Corpusalo. Free time stop. That man advances has been very strong to try to keep him out of the range. Yeah, that target sight might be saying, keep it out of the range. They're nowhere to be found here because they were really are trying to make that one show off. Because they really do. They're not their offense one, not my eye, you a man, and you keeping it. Tolvin in right in the offense zone, passing to Donato. Donato shot stopped by Corpozala. And about to get ready for another faceoff coming in. 15.54 to go. Now to do this one again for the next one to keep it in line. Now here's Olasayek. Shot blocked. In the right is over again to Donato. Morgan to Tolvin in. Right in bounding, Donato! Roy takes the puck away from the, from the Kraken and now they will swing it over on the Kraken territory. Seattle regroups the puck and now swing over to Osayek. Oh, now Tobin in. Back to Donato and offside is whistled on Seattle. Well, they have a good inbounding. They're really trying to pick up the move here because if they don't have it out right, you're going to need to like try to like, get this one straight ahead. Now it's Lizette with the win, and Roy will have it out. Puck in for the blue line. Osayek with the puck down to Tanev. Tanev gets down and bumbled out. They're already been showing it off like they did. They're really trying to get over with the attack. Geeky up, glove saved by Corpozalo. 
They are just going to get this thing done, and right away, the face-off is next. With the two players inbounding, it's a close game, but it's a 2-0 run. Now, I have to say about this one here, Corpus Allo, I've got eyes on him because he's really well. After John Quick has been leaved off with the Kings, he now wants to give that one a dish off to Corpus Allo and find out how he's going to do. Because of this moment, it's really going to be a very dangerous call because a lot of players have a great defenders than the than every other one than John Quick. Because now, John Quick is the biggest part of a goaltender here in the Kings. But for Corpus Allo, it may be that different. It may not be that tough at all, but in that case, it might be too hard to handle it. I'll be watching Corpus Allo to keep an eye on the saves and during the games of this period. Back to you, Test 2. Now the Kings will carry it over with the face-off win. Dowdy will have it mounting right over into the wing to Byfield. Give it over again to Kempe. Stopped by Jones with a save. That pad mark is going to leave a brutal. Kopitar stopped by Jones. Just getting it quickly, and they are really are looking it over. That shot was a hard one. A miss. They really are showing it what they are really doing it. Kopitar wins it. Anderson! Oh, that's a close call, but it's now Jones with a pad save. Really are stepping it up. That's Sean Ferner. Schwartz shot. Stopped by Kopitar. Now holding with only 12.45 to go in the second period. They're still getting warmed up to try to look over again. Little tower wins it over, and now it's Dowdy. Now find it again. Kobatar. Giving the pass to Kempe. Swartz looking over again. Now he will have to try to look it in the corner. Finding Anderson, more stride. And Kobatar will have it back. Their players in this crowd putting up an offense. They are really are trying to pick up the run. They are not really trying to sack it off. They are already been accusing it to go with the impounding. Five field shot stopped by Jones. Larson over again in the offense zone to try to pick up Steve. Try to move around. Anderson over right towards the corner of Fiala. Fiala towards the corner. Thumbs up right up towards the Seattle. Both shot of McCann over to Beniers. Beniers shot stopped by Corbazalo. Then now it goes right over again. Shot stopped. Try to put a rebound in it. Bojan with the puck. Now moving into the offense zone. Everly passes again to Beniers. Beniers trying to move around there by side by side. Arvidsson will try to take over with the puck, and now back to Fiala. Fiala gets bumbled up. Gets crushed two times. It looks like a sea monster is trying to put a, take a look at this. They're really starting to go over with the offending of the line. They're not really saying, not my guy you're looking at. you got to stop. Score! Veneers with a the goal. They're staring up with pride, and that's what happened in the last game. Matty Berniers has already been showing off his spirit. And the all psychic and their team is like unbelievable. When Berniers said, he just said, it's what my team does for his history of the lifetime. They're always on a good inbound. We've really shown a great support. And this love always never stops proving how they did. This is tough enough to make that one a great moment to key the eye strain. I'll be watching here on my nears if he gets another goal. Back to you guys. I follow right over into again to Lizette. Lizette, around the defender, gets blocked. Lizette over into the corner now. The Lordy shots, Stone save. 8.18 to go in a second. They're still trying to get the open man offense to try to leave him off the run. Now they're doing another offense run to get another strike to get in the release. Now with the win, he has it all. 
Now for the Seattle Kraken. Blocked it up by Roy. He now gives it over again. Back to I follow. I follow. Lost the puck and now moves it over to Gordy. Gordy shot. Save me. Gavrikov again to Velarde. The Kings are in the Kraken territory. Puck leaves the zone. Donato racing to the speed in the Kings territory. Now the I follow will have it over again. Try to make it in mounting of the run. Cut it and stop by Jones. Wow, big stop and the motion right towards the wall. This offense is killing them. You know it's not easy because they really are starting to make that one pay for it off. They're going to need to try to fix it up and try to spruce it up. They want to spice it more. I want that one to be like, it's a very hard matchup. They got to go for the win. Block the shot. Schultz. Koyev missed the puck and now Sauji will have it over. Here's the nav right towards the defender. Right around Corpusalo. Stop again here by, by Corpusalo. And with a shot, stop made by Corpusalo. 5.30 left to remain in the second period and Taikayev with the puck. This is a cross around the net. Try to watch for the man offense to go with the run on the attack. Motion in and out. Fine sprunge. Shot. Stopped by Corpusalo. Now we'll get the save ready for just under five minutes remaining. This is ultimately a very tough game that everyone was keeping it over. They're trying to keep that one stride out. Now Kubotar wins the faceoff. Pass to Walker. Over to Kempe. Trying to keep it right into the motion. Kempe shot stopped by Jones. Now over again with the Kubotar. Larson will try to keep him out. Cracking into the territory for the, of the Kings. Long in a shot and try to push it in, but that's not going to help him. Yeah, you don't want to push the goaltender in the net. If you do, you might get a foul on him and the net will come apart. Kopitar wins the faceoff, and now Dursey will have in the offense zone to pick up the run. Kopitar right towards the wing on the outside in the middle. Fighting again. Stop the shot by Jones. Byfield right towards the end field, and now Kempe will take it. From Dursey outside. It's blocked. Warstrap will try to take it over to Swartz. Swartz in the offense. Locked it up. Walker finds Dursey. Three minutes remaining in the second period. Try to leave it from the outside, Kopitar. Five fields, saved by Jones. They've already been showing it up like that. Two on one, it's impossible. But that shot may not be reducing enough power if they wanted to get over this. They've got to show love and technique. Here's a win, Roy. Blocked it again. And done. Right over to the offensive side. Now trying to move it over. Roy will have it in front. Pass to Fiala. Try to keep it in the line. Pass to Arvidsson. Stop by Jones. And Jones will try to squeeze the puck here with just 2.06 to go. The period is winding like down very fast. But you know, it's going to be really that fast when they're going to come by right at it. So if they do, then we might have a little situation to keep it over and out. Gavrikov blocked the shot. Third old shot stopped by Jones. Veneers back into Null. And Pollock saved me. Everly right towards the offense run. Fires around the net. Roy will have it in mounting. Pass to Fiala. No penalty called on Seattle. Fiala, one-timer, blocked up, and saved by Jones. Fiala, that denied the goaltender. Larson right towards the corner, we're down to a minute to play in the second period. they got to get the goals in. That shot goes too wide, and it's now off the defender, and done back to Larson. Now Beniers will have it in the offense zone to pick up their own territory. Beniers right towards the McCann. 
Pat it out! And, wow, good timing released by Corpozala. You know, he's already want to make that one play and just, and just say, not this time, it's going to be up. And you're going to have to end it in the second period fast. Now Gordy will have the win with a face-off. Slap shot it! That's too wide and it's off the range. Pass to Tobin in. Shot, Anderson. Anderson fires it across to the Kraken. Looks like 3-0 turns out to be Kraken there. Looks like they could get a 2-0 series. We'll be right back with you after this. You're watching the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. Be right back after this. It's that time. The third period is about to begin now. We hope you enjoyed watching this part of a doubleheader tonight, tonight's game as the Kings and Kraken are very the top team to try to face an inbounding. This was definitely the biggest part of a game that we've ever seen the Kraken playing for the first time ever since the first time in a franchise history. They never made it that far that easily because of a new team was starting slow. But the second time, uh, the second annual, they are finally in it. Well, as you know, that one, it, the, the Kraken are really the great team. The ultimate greatest victory of the run chain, they really are the best part of a team. They really enjoyed it. Sometimes, however, it really does happen. Most of the games, they really convict that they are important than they know. By Bill the Anderson pass is shot blocked. Now over into the offensive goaltender in, in the corner. Pass broken up. Go Batar again to Anderson. Shot stopped by Jones. And they're holding right now with just 8.25 to go. There are a lot of shots in the attack. They're trying to fight it. They're trying to fight back. They really are trying to like move it over again because they really can't just make it that far. Because of that. They really are starting to get over this and try to get under it to pull it back. Shot! Oh, deflected right into Jones. Larson will have it over again. Passed back to Beniers. Beniers on the attack into the wing. Try to go for two. Everly! Rebound! Scores! McCann has that goal! They're just getting a lot of back-to-back -back switches. Oh, the Kings just say they're all so silent now. It looks like they're not going to get this one good. Well, as we call from Jared McCann, he really impressed me. That one was a definite of this word that was turning out one of the bestest. They say McCann was really done well because of that goal just turned out the biggest part of a star. That was never happened before because now they know they really are stopping it in to put it in bounding. They were really that tough to make that one go in for a better possession to go right through it. I'll be watching on here for the next part of it for McCann. Back to you. And it looks like they'll have to stop here as Copley will be the new defender, goaltender for the for the Los Angeles Kings. After Corbizalo, he refuses to give up. Yeah, after that one here, the long wait, and now with that one, Larson and the team are going to have to try to like put it somewhere else. they got to find some a little room here to try to like put it in bounding. they really got to show off what they got to do. Jones is still one of the best goaltenders here in the Seattle Kraken zone. Very rarely are trying to pick it up from here. They're all saying they, this, this is very uh, impossible to get right towards the defender to keep eyes outside. Now here's the pass over again. Arvidsson shot by Jones is saved. He's the number saving of this game on the wild run. They really are showing it off. Now they're having another fight of like, you know, like in the defensive set, they try to pass it off that quickly. They're really are starting to go inward and outward. Now here's done, right to Everly into the offense zone, back into the Kings territory. Watching Grenier, McCann, stopped by Copley. Dunell over into the uh, wing, and now to the territory of the Kraken. Shot, stopped by Jones. Benitez with the puck now rolling in over again to Larson. 
Larson right towards the wing on the outside. Bernie inside. Larson. Pass to Everly. Shot. Stopped by Copley for the pad save. Many years on the wall. Stop over again, Everly, battling with a loose puck chain. Veneers with the puck. Passes to Dunn. Dunn over to Veneers. Veneers back to Everly. Back again. Stopping the play inbound. I follow, passes to Dunant. Dunant try to put it in with the inbound. Larson over again to Winberg. Passes over again to Borstron. Borstron. Anderson trying to pull up with the puck out of here. Lizette passes over to I follow. I follow lost the puck and Larson will try to hand it back. Now here in the other chain. Stop by Copley with the save. Now the inbounding over to Lizette. The other inbound take. Stop by Jones and will carry the puck here with just only 13.28 to go. If you're disappointed at the New Jersey Devils, unfortunately, they are eliminated against the Carolina Hurricanes. Well, I'm sorry, Jersey fans, because now or never, they're out of here. I hope you've been enjoying with this part of the game. We've seen the Devils making it to the second round since they have already have made it to the playoffs since 2018. That was the first round they played against the Tampa Bay Bucks. But now it is occasionally they will have to see what they can do to try to like put them inbound and at risk. They're going to need to find somebody else here to go with another team to win the Stanley Cup. But now for this game, Hurricanes are trying to battle against the Rangers here. So the Carolina Hurricanes are moving on for the first time since 2018, 19 I should mean. But as of right now, they've already been enjoying it for a while most of the day. And this might be the best one that they always can be. Well, it's definitely what they all say because now or never, Adrian Kempe is in the penalty box. He's not going to have a great day here. Now the power plays on for the Kraken as right now they've got another set of chains going to get an extension run for 5-0 and oh, if they can get that one right away. Now here's Roy with the puck now over into the offense zone. Fires across around the net. Now trying to look for the offense side. Cracking her back into the Kings territory. Shot for Copley. Save. Rolls it over to Kopitar. Kopitar is trying to look over again with the find an open man. Tove in. Puck who's moving out. Trying to go for the short-handed goal. But now... They're back over again with the offense side. Fumbled up. Roy recovers over to Galakov. Galakov right towards the wing. Around the net. 11 minutes going by in a, set, in a third period. Galakov. Short in the goal time. And that is a stop deflection save by Jones. Orshawn right over into the offense zone. Pick up another steam on attack. 2-0-1 broken up. Roy. Decided not to do it this from here as Lizette will try to like leave it over to get the Gabakov. He's almost ready to go back on ice for Kemp. I follow past the Roy shot stopped by Jones. Wild saves this game and the Sea Monster still not is still not down. They're really saying that this has been a great, tremendous game. But the short and the goal, they were really showing it off. Because Jones was really bounded up to be a brutal and pain. As right now, the one player might be out of here. Schultz, right to Everly. Everly passes Schultz. Schultz to Gordy. Seattle back in the wing. On attack, shot, went wide. Now finding again over into the back of the other side, we have his Gordy. Smooth shot, rebound, Copley save. That will hold him with 8.42 to go in the third. And now with that one, we gotta look at the replay for the Kraken. Ow, that is a painful look. Wow. Tolman was really brutal up. He could not believe it that he was already been smashing it out, and unfortunately, he's out. 
Yeah, I guess I have to say that one here. He's done for the rest of the game here in game number two. Hopefully we'll see him back again. But it's great for him to get a goal. We appreciate him. Anderson right over to Kayev. 8.30 remaining. Anderson Dole. In the middle! Whoa! Went so close to the goal line. But now it's stopped by Jones with 8.18 remaining in the third. Here we almost got it in there. Just quick and bounding. I mean... <laughs> Gotta keep that one out of here, out of sight. Now he's in their zone. Fiala and Sprunge will have to take it from here on the outside. Now Anderson will take it over. Puck stopped. Now they're trying to try to find a different look on the offense run. Pickoff run over to Arvidsson. Shot and wow, that went wide off the target. They're already getting shut down right for the offense right now for the Kings. They really are starting to get worried here. They cannot believe what they're going to do. Arvidsson lost it. Borgin recovers it and finds Geeky. Geeky firing around the net. Dowdy will have it back. Arvidsson over again to Fiala. Right around a goaltender. Backhand shot went wide. Just right now, Borgin over again to Tenev. Tenev lost the puck. Kopitar ran into the net. That is sick lifted, and now it's back to Sprunge. Sprunge kicks his puck out of his own. Dowdy into the Kings territory to the Kraken territory. Byfield right into the zone. Kobitar Jones. Wow. That big save is going to be a hard one pressure. Yeah, he is. I do have an update right now. Eli Tolvanen is out of here for this game. He will not be participating here for this part at the end of the game in the third period. Unfortunately, he definitely has been ripped up here and his back was starting to get a little bumped up. All of a sudden now, the chest is starting to go with the painful of this run. He will not be returning for this part of the game as also. All right, thank you, Lightbulb. Here's Gopitar. Dunn takes it over with the buck away from him. Kempe's going to hold it right back over to Walker with under five minutes. Five field shot. Stop again. Larson with the puck now in the corner. Kempe. Bad pass. Now they're going to have to reset it over again in the offense zone. You've got to try to fix it on your own. You don't want to make that one a mistake because if you do, well, they're already been dumping out of here. They're just getting flowing by. McCann moving the puck towards the right around the back over again to Dunn. Dunn right into the center of his own in the wing. Pass again. Stick the lift and Dursey has it over again to Anderson Dolan. 3.35 remaining in the third. Pass to Kayev. Shot. Stopped by Jones. An unbelievable moment is keeping it out of your life. Kayev shot. Stop again. Veneers right towards the wing in the offense zone. Back to McCann and Kayev back to Gout. Leaving the zone. Three minutes going by in the third period. They're starting to get shutting down here for the Kings. Larson. Finds McCann, tries to go over with the attack, but now Beniers has it. Pass to Everly. Everly still looking over. Pass stop. Rebound by Pierre by Everly. Rebound and good stop by Copley. Yeah, Copley's like doing a much that better here. We would have need them in game three. And now with the answer, we have it's Vince Dunn. Vince Dunn is really that impressed. That all this happened right now because he's already turning out one of his better game and his offense was putting up a superstar player on his offensive run with the team. It's very difficult, but don't worry now. Vince Dunn is succeeding with their team to a shout out win if they do it with their successful part of the range. Horse Sean right over into the offense zone. Wember shot. Rebound again and it's stopped by Copley. Just one minute right now and it looks like the Kings are, are having trouble and they are putting up a second game nightmare. Yeah, they always do. 
it's not very easy when they are going to try to like leave it out. Other teams say, this is what we don't do. Kings really have a tough time and they play against the Kraken because Kraken is one of the best new teams and they are looking forward to the conference finals. Might be a great choice if he can make that one in there. Here's Roy in the middle. Schultz back over to Gordy. Gordy goes out of here. Bumbles up. Arvidsson to Lazette. Now finds I follow. Shot stopping down by Jones. Lazette stuck up in the corner of the wall. Velarde. Looking with the shot. Save me. Double time stop. Ten and those seconds remaining and Schultz, I follow. Can get a goal? No, they won't. And that will do for the third period. The Kraken wins their game in a shutout score 4-0 for the first time on NHL EA Sports history. I know they notice Martin Jones is the king of the block shot to put a save in play and they always definitely remember it. Well, that's for me right now. Test tube along with paintbrush and light bulb. This has been a presentation of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate you all. Have a great night. Thank you so much. Here. You too, there, light test tube. Thank you. Good night there, sir. We'll see you again for the next game. You too. Still here. As right now, this has been the end of the game right now as a 4-0 is a shutout score. What a tremendous night for Kraken with a 2-0 series. Time for three star players of the game. The third star goes out to Jared McCann, a goal and two hits. All it does now, rebound it around the goaltender. The second star, on the other hand, as we all have to say, Matty Beneers, a goal and assist. That was putting in with a tightness run to go right towards it. And with that defenseman, right around a goaltender, can never stop. And the first star, Martin Jones, 56 saves. He's perfect. And a total combination was very that tough. Power play for just Kraken. And no goal yet. Penalty kill was two minutes for the Kings. 14 and 32 faceoff wins for Kings in Seattle. 96% and 84% for the passing. 532 and 640 for the time on attack, hits for 23 and 13, and finally 56 and 46 for the Kings and Seattle on the total shots on goal. Well, that's the second done, and as we're being said, Test Tube is finished for tonight's doubleheader game. Stay tuned for the next one. We'll have we'll be off and then we'll be back on. As right now, the Bolts are at Tampa to play against the Bruins. Following along with another game, as we will be seeing the another game, Avalanche and Wilds at Ball Arena. And then, the next couple days will be happening here in Madison Square Garden, Rangers against the Kern Kings, and finally, here in the Climate Pledge Arena, Kraken and the Kings. So that one, I hope you all enjoyed. Peace out, everyone, for a while, as the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports Style. Thanks for all for joining with us, and don't forget to subscribe to his channel. Make sure to follow him on his social media, and they're right down in the description below. Test Tube gone. Have a great night, everyone, and I'll see you all again for the next game. Peace! If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.